I'm Kalina Estrinos and right now in your 13 Action News update, new information on a former local gymnastics coach accused of sex abuse. According to the arrest report, Terry Gray is facing multiple counts of lewdness with a child under the age of 14. Records show he was a gymnastics coach in Las Vegas between 2009 and 2015. Investigators say several gymnasts came forward with a number of claims, including Gray would give full body massages before every practice. Another claim says Gray took her out to see a show and kept touching her and kissing her on the cheek. The state's unemployment agency releasing new numbers. Dieter says it paid out 90% of claims ending in the week of July 11th, and more than 23,000 claims are still pending. The agency says the state has a little over five weeks of money left in its trust fund for unemployment, but Dieter says not to worry that all of the claims will continue to get paid. Well, there is a new way to pay for parking in downtown Las Vegas. You can now use a mobile app or QR code. The code will be posted on meters and at parking lots. Scanning the code will let you use Apple Pay or Google Pay. The city is also using the app Flowbird. It allows you to pay at any parking meter and reserve a space at any of the city's garages. We've got temperatures headed back to the triple digits this Friday afternoon, but a little below average, forecasting 102 in the city, 104 up in North Las Vegas, 102 in Mesquite, and 100 even in Pahrump. Uh, so certainly warm enough this Friday afternoon, plenty of sunshine, breezes around 10 miles per hour. We'll drop into the 90s by 7 p.m. And then after dipping into the 80s by about 10 p.m., we'll look for overnight lows in the upper 70s. A warm weekend, but not as hot as the last three weekends, so that's something. 103 on Saturday, 104 on Sunday. Kalina, next week will be above 105, so the heat returns and perhaps even a few storms by midweek. All right, Justin, thank you so much. And that was your 13 Action News update. You can find more on our website, ktmd.com, and our free mobile app.